There are uh, at least four screening options for colon cancer. The most common one and the one that we recommend as first line is colonoscopy. It is the gold standard for colon cancer screening. Um, not only is it able to detect cancers and polyps, but we can actually remove them at the time of the exam. Uh, the advantage to colonoscopy is the fact that it only needs to be done every 10 years, and so that gives you a, a fairly long time when you don't really need to think about doing another test. Right beneath that um, is a new option. It's called Cologuard. Um, it's a test for colon cancer that involves submitting an entire stool for DNA testing. So unlike testing for blood, it actually looks for the DNA that's shed by tumors. And it's um, extremely sensitive. Uh, we think about 92 to 94 percent of cancers that are present at the time when you turn in the test would be detected. Um, the disadvantage for that is that you would need to have another procedure if it were positive because it, it's only able to detect but not treat or diagnose and so you'd need a biopsy as a second procedure. Another option that's available is what we call FIT testing. Um, this is testing just for blood in the stool. It's part of a process that requires an annual commitment um, to screening. So if, you, if you're going to use FIT testing as the way to test for colon cancer, it'll need to be done every year and that requires a lot of vigilance as far as the doctor and the patient to make sure you don't miss any. So you only get a one year uh, guarantee with a FIT test. And it, it is not as sensitive or specific as the um, Cologuard test or a colonoscopy. And we'll pick up about 70% of colon cancers, but could miss about 30% of them. Uh, the last option is virtual colonoscopy. This is essentially a CT scan uh, that involves special contrast. It is able to pick up probably about 85 to 90 percent of colon cancer. The disadvantage is it requires the same bowel prep as a colonoscopy, and there is a radiation exposure, so that probably is a negative. So I think although it's available, it's a probably second line option.